welcome to Minecraft with Marksman, episode 1. So, I've started the Minecraft series like I said I was going to, and here it is. I am using a seed for 1.4 world, and I'm currently playing on snapshot week 13 07 a is it yeah 07 a week 13 07 a and i'm using the seed capital t capital m capital m i'm also using the custom john smith texture pack the custom john smith texture monkey farms custom john smith texture pack and the seed is also the one that monkey farm uses well is using i've just broke a chest which it contains an iron chest plate, iron oak saplings, apples and bread. Because I've been watching Monkey Farm series, I know where most of the good stuff are on this map. But we're just going to get started like any normal Minecraft series. And if you don't know, I'm going to show you how to go strip mining. This works for the Xbox 360 console as well. I do believe it also works on the um, iPhone for iPhone and Android, but I'm not too sure on them too. But first, we'll just do the boring old punching a tree. Um. And once we go to this, I'm going to go to an area with monkey farm builds, but I'm going to build quite different to what he builds. I do advise you check out his videos, because he's a very good builder at Minecraft in survival. I do, do, I do give a lot of references to his videos, because I do enjoy him and his creations are quite good. He does copy creations off other people as well, but that's Minecraft. So, from where we started, you'll want to look over there and you should be able to see a big tree and that's where the village is. Then if you come in the opposite direction, um, there should be a jungle here. Ah, sheep, good. Always good to see a sheep. Not wrong. I'm just going slightly the wrong way. Just run along here, and there should be a small little mountain range. Say it's not, it's actually quite big. Should be. And there should also be a glitch out texture of all Monkey Farms pigs as well. I think it's M the MC patch are not working probably. Ah, down there it is. I think it's what I was saying was I think it's the MC patcher not working properly with multiple mobs as of the snapshot. Which is inconvenient, but have to deal with inconveniences sometimes. And this is where Monkey Farm is. You can't see it properly because of the because I'm on low render distance. But if you mine here, you'll get a good area. Now I'm going to build something. In the same area as Monkey Farm, but different. But first of all, I'm going to want to start a uh, mine. So you're going to want to dig down to level 11, 12, or 10. Those are the prime locations for strip mining. Right, so we've got that. I'm going to play it without making iron tools straight away 
I'm gonna do it as if you didn't have them, didn't have the iron in the chest. That's so if you want to play it the other way, you can play it normal. You can so a lovely wooden pick. We get the time to my achievement, and then we'll go mining down here. Oh, coal, good. Um, there's also plenty of emeralds around here that I will not be mining till I get silk touch. Not silk touch, fortune three. Ah, good. Plenty of coal. So I'll just jump cut to when I've got down to the mine, okay? And now we're back. Right. So now we're down at level 11 and my FPS dropped in half. Wonderful. I really need a better graphics card. But hey. Right, so now that we're down to level 11, I... I've probably gone halfway down doing this three wider gap, then I'll cut to a single one, and then now we just go in a straight line, hunting for diamonds. Now, ah, right, what I forgot is I need a diamond pick. Now, I don't have any wood or the iron on me, so I'm gonna shoot to the top. Um, Daytime good. And do we have star mobs up here, will we? Good, quick. Um, let's see. Before it goes night, we we'll want free iron. We'll make another stone. Um, is that finished smelting yet? No. Right, I'm smelting um, some cobblestone. Oh, I hate some of the new features in. in the snapshot it's very confusing sometimes I think in the winter stone shovel very awkward to use to say the least in some cases <laughs> see what I mean <laughs> right um, are you not there grub up there that chicken that I'll cook in a sec that was annoying me down in my mind the colder right so I'll just go mining so yeah came to about here and then went down so if I remember correctly um, you go so far down here and then turn right and you're mine so far down here and then you turn right and you should come across an area where you can oh, should have really made that spade as well turn right and mine right and you'll come to a, a big opening and now in that opening there should be love um there should be some lava to your right as you go through and there should be diamonds and emeralds in there so I'm just gonna jump to there once I found it I'll give you the coordinates of where to turn and all that and then we'll be back again okay now we're back Right, as you can see, I found an emerald. Now, to find this emerald, you want to come down from where I mined, come to these coordinates, 115 for your X, and for your Z, 4. And it's on your Y axis of 11. If you go in at mine, and you'll find it here. When you get to the those coordinates, you just want to turn right. Now, 
I had to fight some creepers and bash them over the head with this iron sword. Now in here, there's some diamonds, some redstone, lots of iron, some more iron, some gold, and another piece of emerald. Why does it lag so much when I come to this earlier? I don't know. But anyway, there's also um, some more diamonds in this area. I'll show you where they are and a spider spawner. There's also a skeleton spawner near the surface as well. Well, we don't care about them for now. Um, So there's your emeralds well if you didn't see it before when I was walking past. I think the best thing about this texture pack is that everything stands out and everything looks nice in it. Now I don't is there a skeleton up there? Good no. Right, because when I came into here first I was walking around just placing all the torches. There's a skeleton up there, being a fucking jerk. Being himself, of course, just shooting arrows at you just, just don't want the zombie oh zombie villager please yes. uh, I know there's lava around here. And from Monkey's videos, he lost a diamond whilst trying to get him here. In a very curious space, to say the least. But if you just shift click and. Yes. Just make sure I don't lose any. Um, as I was saying before, the other diamonds are down there. The zombie. Oh, he's worked his way up there. Ah! <laughs> karma. Absolute karma. What was the chances of that being an idiot? I thought they fixed the AI on them. <coughs> Did I get that diamond? There was four. Yeah, I got it. Just block that off so we don't get sizzled to death. So we'll just be back once I've collected all these and I'll be over to the other side with everything lit up and ready to do the mining and all that. Okay, so see you then and I'm going to see what I can do about this lag. This is just so irritating. Okay, bye. And now we're back again. So I've struck gold in the form of a zombie spawner which I will make great use of and turn into a I forgot what it's called why are these cocoa beans not got the texture well, I've got a few pieces I've had enough string to make a bow two saddles some wheat that's good fire protection too that's good unbreaking too now that'll be a nice enchantment to add so we'll just take this chest might as well take the chest we can use them. Got another two saddles, a bucket, some bread so I won't be starving. Um, put that gunpowder up there, put you down there. Um, bring the bread there. Um, that there, that there, that there, that there, there and there. And we'll take that chest as well. 
Now we only want five. Uh, we only want to grab five of the diamonds. One reason. We want to get an enchantment table first. Just light up this area. And enchant ourselves to get the best pickaxe. A fortune free. So what I'm going to do is get another diamond which I do believe are here yes oh there's only one. Oh, that's good I got five and I do believe there's some more diamonds down here should they be behind this core if I remember correctly from monkey farms or LP or maybe it's the snapshots changed it and again the other one was in the right place I don't know, but I know there's more diamonds around here. Very close. So I think that'll be it. I think I've got the name for the episode now. Striking Diamond. And Knobs. And also, I think I've got my intro video with that kamikaze zombie. Um... I built up a little protection here because I had a terrible feeling that I'm going to fall off. I always stick protected. So that's the first episode. Thanks for watching. Please like if you enjoyed or leave a favourite. Comment if you, have, if you have an idea for me to do something in the world. I've got plenty of ideas already. Um, next episode I'll have some obsidian a nether portal and some other stuff built um, I'll s start my cow farm for next episode uh, start a wheat farm as well and all that lovely stuff for next episode I do believe there's some emeralds behind the back of here if I find any I'll show you them Look at that this world's ah I think I figured out what was causing me lagging all that lava. So what I'll do is I'll pour some water over it and sort it. So I've struck gold, found diamonds, found mob spawners, found gold, found redstone, found iron and all that stuff. So all I can say now is stay well and bye.